Hey, welcome back to Dust Off. I'm here with a very special guest, Adam Church. Hello. Best friend since middle school. And late we're middle school, to be well, fair. Late, it's selling us short. We're going to play through Halo 3. We played a whole lot of this game. Ooh, yes. And um, hopefully going to be some crackdown. Don't know if you've already seen that or if it's coming out later or whatever. But <laughs> we're going to be doing the split screen as opposed to system link just because Brandon's I'm a an dumbass <laughs> and totally forgot to bring my power cable. So we only have one Xbox at the moment. Start that time. <laughs> Whoops. So here we go. They let me pick. This was so mind blowing. Did I ever tell you that? So pretty. Choose whichever Spartan I wanted. You know me. I did my research. Watched as you became the soldier we needed you to be. Always assumed that that was the ship. Well, it is the it is the, the ship. ship. Yeah. But it's not from, like, the same voyage. Like, there's, like, a couple weeks in between Halo 2 and 3, right? Something no yeah, they spend, it, they spend it all in hyperspace or in yeah. space. Can you guess? Yeah, there's, like, a comic that explained what happened on that ship, and I never bothered to read it. Yeah, me either. Which is... Cool. Mm -hmm. yeah, that, that always bothered me, the way he just turns like that. We were just talking. We, we did a little test run. Got about halfway through this first level. So a little mm -hmm. bit of As explained in Halo 2, it flies pretty good. <laughs> For a brick. Bricks can turn. <laughs> of their own accord? Wow. Oh, he's dead. You see the lift? Damn. Just how far Pick do we go? Up. Two kilometers. Easy. Stay sharp. That's a long way. That's yeah, farmer. <laughs> I'm just gonna throw on some Kevlar and jump out of a plane. Foreman, his armor's locked up. Gel layer could have taken most of the impact. I don't know, Sergeant Major. Why would it lock up? I assume that's his, like the ability that you get in Reach. That's what that's yeah, but I mean, it's be. like, so when people fall out of a plane, yeah. right, all the people that survive pass out and go limp. Yeah. Or like, why drunk people survive in car crashes. Yeah, because if he's all locked up, like, he's got no no way to move. His brain is just going to be mashed up against the back of his skull. Yeah. Oh, that actually might be the point. Gee! Crazy fool. What do you mean? you always jump? What when you get a like neck injury or something, the first thing they do is make sure you can't move. And I don't do right. bits and pieces. Maybe that's what it was. Yeah, maybe. Wait. Maybe he was limp and then locked Where's up. Cortana? She was there when I left her. Don't make a girl a promise. If you know you can't keep it. She stayed behind. All the people Corporal, make it quick. back in uh, early high school just trying to find a nipple lockdown. in all of us. <laughs> Little flashbacks. Oh, Cortana's naked. Arby! Man, that's gonna taste gun oil for the rest of his life. <laughs> Were it so easy. What a badass. I have always found it a little strange how we must go. the way their mouths move then they must doesn't go. work with English whatsoever. People. But, uh, I guess, like, their armors are translating it on the fly, right? I don't this, know. I I, th I read the first Halo book, and I want to say I remember that being what happens. So they're still speaking Sangali or whatever. And, uh... And then they're, like, it's just coming through your headset. Oh, boy. Okay, so we're going to have a little bit of letterboxing going on here since we're doing split screen. So, hey, other Brandon, go ahead and... Tighten that up a little bit when you get the chance. I'll just okay. immediately go the wrong direction. Yep, it's only been what? How many times have you played through this game? <laughs> a lot. I lost like, track. this has been the game to just go back and replay. You know? team, this is Johnson. We got him. Which is kind of surprising because it's Boop. not Boop. my favorite Halo game. Boop. Which one is your favorite? ODST. 
Yeah, I think that one's a close second for me. I'd have to go with Halo 2. Just because it's still the most mind-blowing. and like, Halo For the technology 2, they had. Halo 2 is alright now that you can immediately play Halo 3. Yeah, that's a good point. At the, the time, yeah. though, Halo 2 was incredibly annoying. Sergeant Major, Phantom inbound. Biggest cliffhanger is it just I've stopped? seen in a video game. Yeah. But, like, it felt... It didn't really feel anticlimactic, though, because it was a huge fight at the end. Yeah? Yeah, it was... And, like, there was a lot of build-up to it. It was getting there. It was just not... It could have gone on a little bit farther. Yeah. I think the real problem was that you play as the chief, or you don't play as the chief. Yeah. Like the last character yeah, that's in true. is an elite, and it's like, what? Yeah, that's also weird in that I like the Arbiter more oh, than look the out. chief. Well, I mean, David Anderson. Fuck, what, what's the voice actor's name? Keith David. Keith, Keith David, yeah. That scene in San Francisco. Oh god. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, Keith David is just... Oh god! He has the coolest voice. Actually, no, I can't... I can't <laughs> if we're comparing them, him to Master Chief, I can't really say that. I need a weapon. Oh. Chief's a badass. Oh. Uh, the, uh, the boo in Halo 2. Yeah. When he teleports in. Yeah, just the little moments like that, making Chief so sassy. Cause he has one a lot of favorite, moments like One of my favorite, yeah, in this game particularly. Yeah. Cortana. I know exactly where, where you're, yeah. Uh-huh. It's probably my favorite line in all of Halo. Oh, we gotta get there quick then, cause I am antsy to hear it. I know what it is, but I'm not gonna say it. I'm gonna have to watch more episodes. Ha. Huh. Okay. Flashlight. Shots in your eyes. Not a very bright flashlight. No. I do like that they added like night vision in what? Reach? Hey, on the oh, no, it was ODST. Uh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think it worked better in ODST than it did in Reach. Oh boy. I might. Have my first death here. It's been a while since I've seriously played Halo. And you're just bad. <laughs> yeah. Not even gonna retort. It's just so Halo to me is like going to normal difficulty and just being a badass, you know? Just being a bullet sponge. Oh shit. I did get good for a while, while I was in clan. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh god, oh no! Well... I didn't see that guy coming. Alright. Two badasses well. killed by a grunt. <laughs> screaming. So now, we actually have the opportunity to stealth mode this. What? These guys are sleeping. Well... <laughs> so much for that. I'm sorry, I only heard be loud. I didn't say that at all. I was oh. saying what I heard. Just even punch this. <laughs> you need to dust off Oblivion and do that. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. shit. Fisting with Punch works really well in Skyrim just because of that, uh. It works best in Fallout. You get the power fist. Oh, shit. Oh, god damn it. And you can do like handlebar mustaches. Uh -huh. <laughs> you best find some cover. Oh, hello. I mean, Fallout 3 is about as old as this game is. Yeah. That counts for. This counts for a dust off. <laughs> it still feels weird. It's not a new game. No. In fact, it's. No, it's not one of the older games. Yeah, but, yeah I just. I got wrecked. <laughs> oh, I must have gotten shot out of the air by that. I'm definitely gonna let this episode run a little long so we can actually get oh somewhere that matters. Oh, hello, Grunt. Shit. 
The last Halo game I played was two. Back up for you. I think he had a little bit more lunge capability with his regular melee. Um. Come here. Shit. <laughs> there we go. Um. Oh yeah, the first achievement I ever got. You're the pink mist. Was the first game you got on 360? Um, no. But, well... You know what? Yes. Because, uh, remember when, uh, Chris Lash's Xbox crapped out? Like, I only had the original. And he was gonna, he was like, I'm gonna go smash it with the sledgehammer. And I was like, dude, no. I'll fix it. What did you do? Um, well, I got it from him, and it, like, it decided to just stop red ringing, apparently. And, uh, so that worked for a few months, and I played it. Oh, shit. I'm trying to reload with X. And now I keep trying to melee with RB. Thank you, Reach. <laughs> I guess Halo 4 did that too, right? Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah. And Sprint was left with B was crouched. But yeah, it red ringed a little while later. And oh hello. Bonk. So I took it apart and replaced the X clamps and everything. And that fixed it for about another month and then it red ringed again. Sup, Cortana. Could you sacrifice me to complete your mission? Yeah. Could you watch me die? Yeah, sure. No, just boots. Oh you're right. That's the only reason to save her. Oh, the only reason to save her. <laughs> You know, all the other very good reasons. BR it up. Probably need that it's ammo more so than good. Clicking on heads. Oh shit. Oh god, that was another thing in Halo 4 that pissed everybody off is that when you get shot while you're scoped, all it does is shake it instead of popping you out. Did it? Yep. Yeah. And it was terrible. Because, like, if you can adjust for that, you just keep shooting someone. So snipers become invincible. I remember this trick. You run a little bit faster if you run diagonally. Shit, I'm gonna die. Nope. Nope, nope. Oh, oh, oh. It's okay, coming in with big guns. Ha ha ha! these snipers. I guess they just have carbines on them. Got it. Oh! Oh, that's a sniper. Now, this will probably be the first dust off that's actually in 1080p. I usually just do 720 because all those old games are not gonna look good when you upscale it to 1080. Shit! Who shot me? Oh god! Chief down! It's all up to the Arbiter now. Alright, once we get around this. Oh, son of a bitch! <laughs> you fucker! Get him. Got him. Oh no! Triple kill. There's another one? Where? I there was another one. Uh, there's one over here, I want to say. Yeah. Okay. Sipping up in the tree. I ate that grenade. Alright. I think right now it's a good time to continue this next time. Thanks for watching, everybody. Good to have you. Uh, Adios. Uh.